Hi Taurus, I will be doing your uh, monthly reading this month for the month of January. So hi, I would like to welcome you guys back to my channel. How you guys doing? What's up? What's good? What's hood and what's life Taurus? So let's see what we got for the month of January for you guys. And it looks like you guys got a lot going on. So let's see. So we have the new vision here in the upright. So that lets me know that Taurus, you guys are kind of like coming out in this almost like I'm coming out type of thing, like on the Whitney Houston. Uh, I wish I could sing it, but you know copyrights. But <laughs> if anybody knows that song, that's kind of that. You do have the courage here in the reverse. So that is a lesson here where the universe is kind of saying to you this month, Taurus, like, don't be afraid to like step out and fearlessly be yourself. Like, this is kind of that time where you can just do it relentlessly and fearlessly and almost effortlessly, right? Moment to moment here is in the reverse. So Taurus, it is kind of letting me know that you are just like all into work. You're not really present where you need to be. <clears throat> but that's not to say that that's not going to change, right? And then here is your turning in card, also here in the reverse, Taurus. So this is kind of just letting me know that you are just not present with your emotions, but that is going to change. So, Taurus, I really would like for you to consider, you know, taking a time out to just really check into yourself, really see what's going on with you. What would you like to kind of do with your life a little bit? What else do we got for this sign of Taurus? <clears throat> we got cards everywhere, right? Oh, so you guys do have the pride card here, and that's coming from an Aries. Taurus, put your pride aside and let people help you. It's okay to say that you need help. It's okay to say that you're tired, and it's okay to say you don't have all the answers right now. Like, you're not always expected to, and I know that Taurus, with you being like an earth sign and everything like that, you guys are like all about stability and having a good foundation and all of these types of different things. But Taurus, it's okay to not have everything all together. It's quite all right. Like, it's definitely okay. Um, here's the timeout card. Timeout card literally says take a break. Take a timeout from, like, all of the work that you're doing, whether you're studying, whether you're a parent, whether you're, you know, in a high-demand um, essential career, right? It's just take a time out to deal with your feelings, deal with your emotions, and be present within Taurus. What does Taurus want? What does Taurus have going on, right? And then here's your happy ending card. It's pretty self-explanatory, right? You will have all that you desire if you just take the moment to just go back into you. Like, pay attention to you. What's, what's going on with you? You know what I mean? What else do we got going on for the month of January, Taurus? Let's see, let's see, let's see. What else do we have for the sign of Taurus for the month of January 2021? For the month of January. Thank you. Look, you got personal transformation and you have the Splendor card. So, Taurus, this is letting me know that, like I said, once you decide to take that moment and just take some time out for you again, look, <laughs> time out so once you take the time out to like deal with you deal with your emotions and your thoughts and kind of do like a mental check-in like hey how's Taurus doing like how am I feeling today or like be present enough in your body be present enough in your career to say what's going on or what can I do differently or you know what what steps have I already taken so Taurus think of it like this just because 5 plus 5 equals 10 doesn't mean the same does not go for 7 plus 3 or even 15 minus 5. You just might have to take a detour. And that's okay. You know what I mean? And let's see what else. Ooh, you got the Eclipse in Aquarius. So the Eclipse in Aquarius says awakening. And it says your deeper resolve rises. So with this being said, uh, Taurus, this is kind of like... <sighs> take a time, like I said, to meditate. To be present within your body, within your thoughts, your mind, body, and spirit. To come collectively together to say like, okay, this is what I want to do. These are the steps that we're going to take. Because like I said, in the beginning, your new vision card here is in the upright. This is a lesson that you're going to have to learn. But you first have to have the cur You first have to have the courage to do so. So this month, Taurus, the universe is asking of you to take some time out for you. I know you're usually there for everybody else, but... Taurus, it's time to be there for you. 
So I really hope this helped you. Um, I hope this brought you some type of clarity. And I'll see you guys next month. All right, see ya. <laughs>